Hi, I'm Nisende. Cobalion, Trakion, and Verizion are legendary Pokemon from the Unova region that are also known as the Three Musketeers or the Swords of Justice. One of those names is way cooler than the other. Anyway, in this video I'll be making new forms for them for my Opelucid region, which is just Unova from the future, Legends Arceus style. Let's get right into it. Cobalion is a calm and composed Pokemon with the heart of a leader. It fights against humans in the defense of the Unova region's Pokemon. It's also a steel fighting type. The idea for the forms I'll make is to turn the designs completely on their head. Cobalion's steel heart has been melted and corroded by the relentless evil of Team Plasma. Its body has been completely deconstructed, and only a shell of its composure remains. It is now known as the Glass Might Pokemon. Cobalion is a water ghost type Pokemon with the ability Rattled and signature hidden ability. Double Edge boosts the power of this Pokemon's attacks by 1.5 times, but it loses 10% of its total HP after using a powered up move. It's basically a life orb, but stronger. It has a signature move called Glass Sword, which is a strong ghost type special attack with the same effect as Glaive Rush. Basically, the next attack against it does double damage. Although Cobalion can hit incredibly hard, it often flees from battle instead of attacking. It uses the noise of rushing water to mask its own sounds. Although it hasn't been seen in many years, you can tell it's near when you hear a waterfall when there's no waterfall nearby. This phantom waterfall effect has been noticed across Opelucid, but is more common in deep caves. Those who have studied it the most note that it has the personality of a child, and can be heard giggling when someone chases the sound of water that isn't there. Terrakion is a powerful Pokemon that can bust through a giant castle wall in one blow. It works hard to protect small Pokemon and mercilessly crushes bullies. It's also a rock fighting type. Recently, Terrakion's phenomenal power and will to protect was crushed by Team Plasma's constant evil deeds. It has hidden away somewhere remote and avoids conflict. It is now known as the Hermit Pokemon. Terrakion is an ice psychic type Pokemon with the same abilities as Cobalion. It has a signature move called Hermit's Sword, which is a status move that boosts the user's defense, special defense, and speed by one stage, but lowers its attack and special attack by one stage as well. Terrakion lives above the clouds near Twist Mountain. Recently there have been near constant blizzards at the peak, and meteorologists are sure this is the work of Terrakion. The reflection of its shell can be seen at night, and its crystals shine like stars. Some say these blizzards are the result of a tantrum because a hiker refused to give it the candy he was storing in his bag. These claims can be confirmed. Verizion is a swift Pokemon that cuts its foes with sharp, blade-like horns. It moves like a whirlwind and darts around as it fights. It worked with Cobalion and Terrakion to protect its friends, and is also a grass-fighting type Pokemon. Team Plasma has corrupted Verizion as well, but more directly. Verizion now fights for humanity against Pokemon. It corrupts life around it, turning grasslands to barren plains. It is now known as the Wasteland Pokemon. Verizion is a poison dark type Pokemon with the ability Poison Touch and hidden ability Double Edged. Its signature move is called Wasteland Sword, which is a strong dark type physical attack that lowers the user's speed by one stage. Verizion hits like a truck with a speed of thunder. It mercilessly perforates and mutilates its victims with sharp kicks and saps their life force. It can silence a crowd with its glare and put them to sleep in seconds. This Pokemon is unfathomably dangerous and has been the main source of Team Plasma's success with their world takeover. One can only hope Team Plasma has full control of Verizion, as the only alternative is this Pokemon running free to turn all life to dust. Well, <laughs> that's about it for this video. My next Pokemon video will be much more low-key about Ducklet and Suana. It's been a hot minute since I had to animate an evolution sequence. Anyway, I hope to see you there, maybe even on my other types of videos, and thanks for watching!